Hey guys, Johnny here back with a brand new Call of Duty Mobile video. Today, how to get the brand new free skins in COD Mobile. Yesterday, there was an update with new events and they added three more free skins that you can get. Two of these are super easy. The last one's gonna be a bit of a grind, but still today on stream, I was using that one. I think it's my favorite Spec Ups one. And everyone was asking, how do you get the new Spec Ops 1? Well, guys, uh, first of all, it's called Burial Ground. I think it's my favorite Spec Ops 1 in the game. I know there's a bunch of cool ones, but I really like that one. The blue, dark blue, light blue, orange, uh, super cool skin. And it's pretty easy to get. So let's get into it. First of all, what are these three skins that you can get for free? Uh, this one's the first one. There's also a Nomad skin that you can get here on the Dog Tag Duty event. So that one you gotta go on Featured. And uh, yeah, all you gotta do is play the new Grind game mode from the Grind playlist. So you need to do, I think, 15 games and then collect 200 Dog Tags uh, and win 6 games. So I was done pretty early. You don't actually have to play all the games. If you get the 6 wins early and you collect the Dog Tags, I think you don't have to play 15 games, but there's the Nomad Snowblind. It's right here, and honestly, uh, it takes like less than an hour. If you do good, uh, the new game mode is super fun, by the way. The grind game mode, I enjoy. Uh, there's a lot of action. It's pretty fast. You can win fast if you have a good team. So yeah, this Nomad skin is pretty cool, uh, and you can have it for free. Now... Uh, let's go for the spec ups because that one is like the one you want to know, right? So it's the counter intelligence here on the left uh, You have to collect soldiers and then you have to unlock Areas of the map and each area has got different rewards. So if you want to get the spec ups fast Go straight for it in a straight line. So I want to show you where it is It's right here in the middle at the bottom so technically, you only have to open three territories to get the spec ups. The first one you get for free at the start. The West Germany, you get it right when you start. They give you a thousand soldiers or a thousand spies. So your next move should be that one, but it's 6K. It's a bit more expensive. These two are cheaper, but you're going to have to open one extra. You're going to go 3K and 4K before you can go here. So you might go for that one, it's 6,000 total. It's the cheapest way. So start, go to that one, and then that one is gonna be 8K, 8,000 soldier or spies to get the spec ups, all right? And then the, the big reward is right there. After that, you can go on top and get the new outlaw Arctic threat is right there also. Now the last soldier, <laughs> I think you're not gonna like this, but it's actually super cool. If you don't like it, like you, you're gonna save a lot of time. But if you want the last soldier, the Terrence Brooks. Now here's the grind, guys. You're gonna have to play a lot to get the Terrence Brooks Deep Snow. How to get that? You have to unlock all 21 territories on the map. Now this Terrence Brooks soldier, I like it. Personally, I will go for it. I think it looks awesome. Uh, it fits the new season. Uh, I like the colors because some Terrence Brooks we had in the past are not that great. Uh, lime green, the red one, they're a bit flashy. Would be one of my favorite Terrence Brooks skins also. Maybe top three, top two, I don't know. So anyways, uh, unlocking all areas of the map is gonna be a bit of a grind. Like, I played, I think I played maybe four hours yesterday. And four hours today, and I have the 50% extra bonus. And I unlock six areas. Now, I think I did unlock the most expensive ones, though. I unlocked the 8K and the 10K. After that, you got some cheap ones. 2K, 4K, 3-3 on top. So, like, the big ones are done. After that, I'm not saying it's going to be cheap, but it's going to be a bit faster. So, uh, yeah, you might go for it. You might skip it. Uh, how to get more spies faster. Uh, there's two game modes or two playlists that are going to give you more spies. Look at the bottom left. They say you can play any game modes. They're going to give you spies. Play multiplayer or battle royale. It doesn't matter what you play. You get agents. But if you play the grind playlist or if you play the winter and summit playlist, 
you're going to get extra spies per game by playing these lists. So what I've been doing pretty much is uh, playing the grind playlist because you get two things at once. You're going to get your nomad skin at the same time. So you might want to go for the grind playlist. Plus, it's fun, so why not, right? Now, of course, if you don't want to grind too much, but you want all the rewards, you can also buy the set bonus, the ice crystal. If you have the man of war, the axe, and the cryo bomb, it's going to give you 50% extra agents. So once again, you don't need that. It's going to help if you don't have that much time to play. But guys, to complete this event, you have a whole 10 days. It's going to end on the 17th. So I think it's nine more days after tonight. Uh, you have to play for sure. Like If you want to go for everything, you're going to have to put the time in to get that Terrence Brooks. But if you don't want Terrence Brooks, like I said, just a couple hours and you should be done by the end of the weekend. So yeah, that's it, guys. That's the way to get the new Spec Ops 1 uh, Burial Ground. I like it for real. Super cool skin. Let me know in the comments, are you going to go for Terrence Brooks or not? Are you going to grind like a madman to get this dude? Deep Snow Terrence Brooks. I'm doing it, by the way, but yeah, I'm going to have to play a lot of grind. So anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Hope the video was helpful. Smash like if you enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel for daily comable videos. I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care.